What is acetylcysteine inhalation? And what is acetylcysteine inhalation used for? Acetylcysteine inhalation is used along with other treatments to relieve chest congestion due to thick or abnormal mucus secretions in people with lung conditions including asthma, emphysema, bronchitis and cystic fibrosis, an inborn disease that causes problems with breathing, digestion, and reproduction. Acetylcysteine is in a class of medications called mucolytic agents. It works by thinning the mucus in the air passages to make it easier to cough up the mucus and clear the airways. How to use acetylcysteine inhalation? Acetylcysteine comes as a solution, liquid, and concentrated solution to inhale by mouth using a nebulizer, machine that turns medication into a mist that can be inhaled. When using a nebulizer, it is usually used three to four times a day. When given by other methods, acetylcysteine should be used as directed. Use acetylcysteine at around the same times every day. Follow the directions on your prescription label carefully, and ask your doctor or pharmacist to explain any part you do not understand. Use acetylcysteine exactly as directed. Do not use more or less of it or use it more often than prescribed by your doctor. Only mix acetylcysteine with other medications if instructed to do so by your doctor. The concentrated solution of acetylcysteine should be mixed with normal saline or sterile water and used within an hour. There may be a slight unpleasant odor when you use acetylcysteine that goes away quickly. In an opened bottle of acetylcysteine, there may be a color change to a light purple, but it will not affect use. Acetylcysteine should only be used with nebulizers made of plastic or glass. Acetylcysteine should not be routinely used in a hand bulb operated nebulizer or put directly into a heated nebulizer. Talk to your doctor or pharmacist about the correct nebulizer to use with acetylcysteine. Clean your nebulizer immediately following each use. If you do not clean your nebulizer properly, the nebulizer may become clogged and may not allow medication to be inhaled. Follow the manufacturer's directions carefully and ask your doctor or pharmacist if you have any questions about cleaning your nebulizer. Other uses for this medicine. Acetylcysteine is also sometimes used to treat people who have taken or received an overdose of acetaminophen, Tylenol, others. Talk to your doctor about the risks of using this medication for your condition. When to use acetylcysteine inhalation? Before using acetylcysteine. Tell your doctor and pharmacist if you are allergic to acetylcysteine, any other medications, or any of the ingredients in acetylcysteine inhalation. Tell your doctor and pharmacist what other prescription and non-prescription medications, vitamins, nutritional supplements, and herbal products you are taking or plan to take. Tell your doctor if you have or have ever had asthma. Tell your doctor if you are pregnant, plan to become pregnant, or are breastfeeding. If you become pregnant while using acetylcysteine, call your doctor. What should I do if I forget a dose? Use the missed dose as soon as you remember it. However, if it is almost time for the next dose, Skip the missed dose and continue your regular dosing schedule. Do not use a double dose to make up for a missed one. What side effects can acetylcysteine inhalation cause? Acetylcysteine may cause side effects. Tell your doctor if any of these symptoms are severe or do not go away. Nausea. Vomiting. Fever. Runny nose. Swelling of the inside of the mouth throat irritation, drowsiness, cool, moist skin. Some side effects can be serious. If you experience any of these symptoms call your doctor immediately or get emergency medical treatment. Chest tightness, wheezing, difficulty breathing or swallowing, coughing up blood, hives, rash, itching, Acetylcysteine may cause other side effects. Call your doctor if you have any unusual problems while using this medication.